computer and electronic device. Today we will learn about what is a computer. Computer is an electronic device. Now, do you all know what is an electronic device? An electronic device is a device which is used to process electronic data or the digital data. For example, the mobile phones, fax, pagers, and computers. Computer is used almost everywhere. Now you all must have seen that we see computer everywhere at homes, in the shops, banks, schools, and hospitals because we can use computers everywhere. Now we will learn how. So computer help us to do many things. Computer can help us to do a lot of different things. Like we can draw pictures on computer. You must have drawn pictures on a computer in your school. You can play games. So computer can be used to play games. And type letters. We can type letters to form words and sentences on a computer. We can solve sums. We can do a lot of calculation with the help of computer. We can listen to music. You all must have explored this. Have you ever listened music on the computer? And we can watch movies. Now that's your favorite. We all can watch movies on a computer. Now, how is computer different from a human being? Now, we can also do a lot of things. We can sing, we can dance, right? But we are different from a computer. Now, we will learn how a computer is different from us. Okay? So, a computer works very fast and can do many jobs at the same time. We can also do a lot of things together, like we can listen to somebody and write. But, a computer can do all this work very quickly, very fast, and it can do more than one work at the same time. Human needs more time to do any work as compared to a computer. We can also do work, but we need more time to do that work when we compare it with a computer. A computer can do it very quickly, but we need some more time to do that. A computer has a good memory. It never forgets anything that is stored in it. Now, whenever we store anything on a computer, like we save anything on the computer, it could be a picture, it could be songs, it could be movies, or it could be the letters. We have typed something on the computer. So the computer will remember it for a longer time because it has a very good memory. It will remember that work till we remove that work from the computer memory. A man may forget the information stored in his brain. Now you all know all our information is stored in our brain which is called our memory. But we can forget a lot of things. A computer does not make any mistake. Now, see, we all make mistakes. That's why we have erasers with us. We can erase our mistake and write it again. But a computer will never make mistake. If you press A on the keyboard, the computer will show A on the screen. It will not show you B because it will never make mistakes. A human can make mistake. As I told you, being a human being, we make mistakes and we, can, we should always correct them. A computer cannot take its own decision. Now, a computer cannot take its 
its own decision. It will only work on our orders. It cannot play a movie on its own unless and until we play the movie on the computer. The computer will not start drawing on its own unless and until we open the drawing application and start drawing. So the computer cannot take its own decision. A human can take decisions. We can take decisions. If we want to draw something, we can draw. If we want to listen to the music, we, sh we can listen to the music. We don't need anybody's orders to do our work. A computer works on man's orders. As I told you, the computer will work only when we will give an order to the computer to work. If we press A, then only it will type A on the screen. If we are not pressing any key, the computer cannot type on its own. A human does not need any order to work. We can take our own decisions and we work on our own. We don't need orders from anybody to do our work. A computer does not have any feelings. For example, if you hit a monitor, it does not react. Why will it not react? Because a computer does not have feelings. If you touch the monitor or you hit the monitor, the monitor will not start crying. Or if you crack a joke, the monitor will not start laughing because a computer does not have any feelings. A human has feelings. For example, if you get hurt, you feel it. Now, if you get hurt, you feel the pain and you cry. Why? Because you have feelings.